All right, guys, today we're gonna to be pulling the harmonic balancer off of the LS engine so we can get the front rear, or I meant the front main and everything replaced in it. You are going to need a 15 16 socket to remove the harmonic balancer bolt. Basically, once you uh, get that off, it's useless. I mean, you can use it to retorque your new one, but you'll have to replace the bolt. You can buy GM, which is a torque to yield as well, but I just went ahead and bought an ARP. So whenever I replace it, it can be reused. And the uh, puller we're gonna be using is a OEM Tools harmonic balancer puller kit. Um, I'm guessing 25090 is the part number. But I will, uh, I'll link it down in the description and uh, I'll do the ARP harmonics balancer bolt as well. And I'll also do the front seal, but we'll do all that later. So I'm gonna start with the second to longest rod. That's what everybody recommends. They say if you just go straight to that one, you'll bend it. So we're gonna go ahead and get this bolt removed and uh, we'll start pulling the balancer. So they recommend really lubing this up before you uh, insert it into the puller, so that way you're not stripping threads, anything like that. Now I went ahead and used the second to longest rod. You're just going to insert your puller directly in there. There's three little tabs that the jaws will catch on. Just, just keep threading it in there until it gets tight. Those are the tabs I'm talking about. There's three of them. The jaws of the puller will fit right onto it. Then basically you'll just run this one all the way in until it starts pulling the balancer off. And we'll back it all the way back off. Pull our puller. We're gonna replace the second to longest rod with the longest rod now. The only reason we did that is uh, a lot of the reviews said that they bent their longest rod just going straight to it. So to avoid that, went to the second longest. Get our puller set back up on them tabs. Make sure your puller is turned on them jaws. Or make sure your jaws are on the tabs all the way, missing one of them. There we go.
that's all there is to removing a harmonic balancer on an LS. This puller was relatively affordable. I think it was like 50 bucks, which you're going to need it. I mean, you might be able to get away with a different brand, different style, but you're going to need that, uh, that push rod as well. So now we can get to the front main, replace the seal. I've got a couple like, uh, alignment tools coming so we can do that but that's as, as simple as it is to remove the harmonic balancer i also bought an install tool to uh put it back on we'll get it cleaned up get it painted make it look a little prettier or we might replace it if it's relatively cheap enough but thanks for watching guys if you like the video like comment subscribe we'll catch you on the next one